it's like 5.30 a.m. Hello and welcome back to my channel. So this week's video, we are gonna be doing a full week of workouts. Um, I'm kind of excited, but not excited to film this because um, if you saw my last few videos, you know I'm training for a 5K, but my progress has been halted just a little bit because I hurt my hip a little bit. Um, nothing crazy, nothing major, but I do have like a strained TFL, I think. I don't know. It hurts like right here most of the time. When I'm like sitting, running, walking, doing nothing, it bothers me. So this is gonna be a video all about me, what I do to work out training for a 5K and rehabbing my IT band because your TFL is attached to your IT band. So today's Monday, I'm going for a run. So I need to release my TFL with this tennis ball and then I'm just gonna do a slow three mile jog. So I'm trying to keep the intensity down. I mean the speed down and just keep the mileage up I've been doing. So gonna do that, I'll show you what exercise I do. I'm probably a great patient for personal, not personal training, physical therapy, because I actually do all the exercises they tell me to do. Kind of a bummer video, but also I think like good and honest and real, because injuries do happen, overtraining does happen. Even though I thought I was doing it all well, I thought I was like miling up like slowly, but I guess not. I am almost 26 and I'm not as limber as I was when I was 18. Let's get this PT done so I can go for a nice little jog. <laughs> Stride class a little bit ago. I'm eating some protein oatmeal, just oatmeal, Propel Life, chocolate protein, blueberries, and peanut butter. So good. And I'm sipping on some protein coffee actually. I want to talk about my Stride class. Um, it was a good class. The music was awesome. Um, and I took it a little bit easier. I did an extended warm up while the class like got into it. Um, and it was good, I felt good, my hip felt better during it, but I didn't push myself as hard as I normally do, which was a bummer, like I really wanted to, um, but I knew like I just need to keep the intensity down and I can hopefully bring the intensity back next week. It's like kind of weird to be like, oh, like I wanted to go harder, but I couldn't. Um, but I was just really trying to listen to my body. But yeah, it was a great class, second workout of the week done. So that is kind of my like speed work for running. Um, we also did a little bit of arms, like a little bit of biceps, triceps, which is great because I don't want to do like a, I'm not doing like a uh, arm day this week. I'm doing legs, but I'm not doing arms because I want to build more my legs than my arms right now. So that was nice just to get a little bicep, tricep work in, a little core work in there. And it was a great workout. So, get a shower, finish my food and my coffee, and get on with my day. Okay, now let's go to Soul Cycle. Does anyone else just like can't get their keys in their car like ever? Maybe it's just me. like 5 30 a.m. It's really freaking early and I went to a Quinn 92 concert last night so I went to bed at about midnight but we're about to go get it done. We're about to go to a full body hit class basically. I love pre-workout but today I really 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 need it. Love you Propel Life. So to explain what I'm doing here, I'm releasing my TFL, which is attached to my IT band, and then I'm doing some glute activation exercises to tell my glutes to take the load instead of my IT band. So I did this every single day before I worked out, even if I didn't video it. 
and it has honestly helped so much. While I am not a physical therapist, my friend Steve is, and he is super knowledgeable and is the one who told me to do this. So as you can see, I do a pretty extended warm up for this leg day. And then we get into the actual workout. So I started with some deadlifts, some conventional straight leg deadlifts, which are a personal fave. Then into some sumo squat pulses. Did that for four rounds. Then I'm going into hip thrusts, which there are no good way to film. And then some goblet squats to get a little bit of my quads. This last superset, I did overhead lunges. as well as banded good mornings. And in full disclosure, I only filmed this and didn't have time to actually do this last superset, but if you do this workout, I highly recommend you do the final superset. Then I went iced in sauna, which has amazing benefits for recovery, as well as your breath and your hormones, your lymphatic system, all that good stuff. I was supposed to stay in there for like 20 minutes and I did like eight. <laughs> Okay, happy Sunday. It really feels like it's been a minute since I talked to the camera only because it has been. Um, I went to Soul Cycle and then I did a full body hit class at Cause and then I lifted legs on Friday and then Saturday I didn't do anything. I was at a work trip off Catalina Island at a camp um, and now it's Sunday. We just got back from the camp a few hours ago and I'm gonna go for a run and then ice bath and sauna again like I did on Friday. But I just want to mention that I have been, you've probably been noticed, I've been trying to film it. I've been rolling out my TFL every single time before I work out and doing glute activations. But notice when rehabbing an injury I do it before I work out every single time and if you want it to work like you can't go to a PT and just have them automatically fix you, um, you have to put in the work too. So I'm not gonna film that today um, because I filmed it probably every other time I've worked out, but no, I have been doing that and as well as doing other things, Right now, running is my main goal, but I'm cross training with spin, still lifting legs, and doing a full body um, hit strength session um, because I still want to be a well rounded athlete. But running is a focus, so today we are running. Um, we'll see how I feel with my hip. I'm planning on doing two or three miles because tomorrow I'm probably going to do a little bit of a longer run, but the video will have ended by then. So that is the plan for today. Hopefully, I feel good. Hopefully, I've definitely been feeling better in my hip. Um, and I think all the PT is working, but cross my fingers, feel good during this run. So then we're gonna ice bath and sauna, which is gonna feel so good. Mm -hmm. 